The day began with a wreath laying ceremony at the National Heroes Park for the first Premier and first Prime Minister of Antigua and Barbuda, Sir Cornwall Bird Sr. Known as the father of the nation, he was very instrumental in leading the country into independence from Britain. Governor General Sir Rodney Williams, Prime Minister the Honorable Gaston Brown, Culture Minister the Honorable E.P. Chet Green, and the heads of the security forces led the wreath laying ceremonies. Wreaths were also placed at the tomb of the country's second Premier, Sir George Walter, who was also an advocate for full independence for the Twin Island state from the British. Then it was off to the monument of Prince Class on Independence Drive where wreaths were also laid. Prince Class was the leader of the unsuccessful slavery revolt in 1736, which is credited as a seminal moment in the freedom struggle. Minutes later, there was a similar honor for the nation's only female national hero, Dame Georgiana Nellie Robinson. Wreaths were laid at her tomb in the St. John's Public Cemetery on Fries Hill Road. She was remembered for her tremendous contributions towards the transformation of education in the Twin Island State. Al Siena Titter reporting for ABS News.